Hello and welcome to this video on Electronic Data Processing. Electronic Data Processing, or EDP, refers to the use of computers and other electronic devices to manipulate, store, and transmit data. It is an essential part of modern business and plays a vital role in many industries, including finance, healthcare, and government. The first electronic data processing systems were developed in the 1950s and were primarily used for scientific and military applications. However, as computers became more powerful and affordable, they began to be adopted by businesses and other organizations for a wide range of purposes. EDP systems are used for tasks such as payroll processing, inventory management, and customer relationship management. They can also be used for data analysis and reporting, helping organizations to make informed decisions based on real-time data. One of the main advantages of EDP is its speed and efficiency. Computers can process and analyze vast amounts of data much faster than humans, allowing organizations to make quicker and more accurate decisions. EDP systems can also reduce the risk of errors and improve the accuracy of data by automating processes that were previously done manually. Another advantage of EDP is its ability to store and access large amounts of data quickly and easily. With the use of databases and other storage systems, EDP systems allow organizations to store and retrieve data as needed, improving their efficiency and productivity. There are, however, some potential drawbacks to EDP. One concern is the potential for data breaches and cyber attacks, which can compromise sensitive information and have serious consequences for organizations and individuals. It is important for organizations to implement strong security measures to protect their data and systems. Overall, electronic data processing plays a crucial role in modern society and is likely to become even more important in the future. It has the potential to greatly improve the efficiency and effectiveness of businesses and organizations, but it is important to carefully consider the risks and benefits of EDP and take steps to protect sensitive data. EDP systems can be used to support a variety of different functions within an organization, such as accounting, human resources, and marketing. Many EDP systems are now cloud-based, which means that they are accessed and managed over the internet. This can be more cost-effective and flexible than on-premises systems, but it also raises questions about data security and privacy. EDP can facilitate communication and collaboration within and between organizations. For example, email and messaging systems allow employees to communicate with each other and with customers and partners in real time, regardless of their location. EDP can also be used to support decision-making by providing real-time data and analytics. For example, a retail company could use EDP to track sales data and analyze customer behavior to identify trends and make informed decisions about its product offerings and marketing strategies. It is important for organizations to carefully plan and implement their EDP systems to ensure that they are effective and meet the needs of the organization. This can involve selecting and configuring hardware and software, training employees on how to use the systems, and establishing processes and policies to ensure the security and integrity of the data. In summary, electronic data processing has revolutionized the way that organizations store, process, and analyze data, and has significantly improved their efficiency and effectiveness. However, it is important to carefully consider the risks and benefits of EDP and take appropriate steps to protect sensitive data and systems. EDP systems have the ability to handle and process large amounts of data, which can be especially useful in industries such as finance and healthcare that generate and work with a lot of data. EDP systems can also automate many tasks and processes, freeing up employees to focus on more strategic and value-added activities. One of the key challenges of EDP is ensuring that the systems are reliable and available when they are needed. This requires careful planning and maintenance of the hardware and software, 
as well as robust disaster recovery and backup processes to ensure that data is not lost in the event of a system failure or data breach. As EDP systems become more complex and integrated with other systems, there is also a need for skilled professionals to design, build, and maintain them. This includes roles such as database administrators, systems analysts, and IT managers. It is important for organizations to stay up to date with the latest developments in EDP and be prepared to adapt to new technologies as they emerge. This can involve investing in training and development for employees and staying informed about new software and hardware products that could improve the organization's EDP capabilities. In conclusion, electronic data processing is an essential part of modern business and plays a vital role in many industries. It has the potential to greatly improve the efficiency and effectiveness of organizations, but it is important to carefully consider the risks and benefits and take appropriate steps to protect sensitive data and systems. Thanks for watching this video on electronic data processing.